Hey everybody, welcome back to Aaron's Tech Review and Tips, and today I have got something amazing for you. It is the Raspberry Pi. Not just any Raspberry Pi, but this one here, I decided to start a project that uh, kind of took my skills and kind of shrunk them down just a little bit. And uh, I've made a Raspberry Pi, well, I'm in the process of making a Raspberry Pi wall-mounted, water-cooled computer. So um, without any further, I know that's what you're here to see. So without any further ado, let me take you. I'm going to grab the camera. I'm going to move it over and we're going to take a look at it together. So here we go. Uh, you guys get to see my house a little bit. Okay, let's take a look. There it is, guys. As you see, it's still a work in progress. But uh, it is, let me get it down here a little bit. You can see it is pushing the water through. It is water cooled. So now the cool thing about this is this will all be mounted on the wall. Right now I'm just kind of doing a test thing, but I've got a GPIO ribbon running underneath with two GPIO female plugs. So I can actually easily plug things in from the wall and continue to make this thing uh, better and better. Um, but uh, yeah, it is fully water cooled. Now I don't need a radiator on this. I will be putting a fan in, but you can see right now I've got it kind of going through a beer bottle. My um, reservoir is on order and should be here in the next couple days. Uh, part two, I'll actually show that. But once I get this all measured out and everything done, what I'm going to do is uh, mount it and build the case with laser cut acrylic with all the holes where it needs to be and everything and uh, mounting position for the joystick. But uh, yeah, as you can see right now, I mean, it's working. I've got it on my second monitor over here. Uh, just kind of going through, as you can see here, I'm kind of doing it. So let's just kind of, I'm going to shrink that down a little bit. I don't know if you can see it very well, but right now it's running at 34, 33 degrees. Uh, it is overclocked and uh, I've got it overclocked right now to 1000.1 megahertz and I'm still running only 34 degrees. Uh, normally this would be sitting around 50, 52 degrees Celsius. So it's, it's not too shabby. Um, and the performance, of course, isn't as good as my mainstream computers, but, uh, you know, it's still pretty nice. So let's just kind of go back here. Just take a look at the water-cooled Raspberry Pi. Um, and uh, I think you guys will agree that it is pretty sweet when it's all said and done. So I will keep you updated. Again, let's put this back over here. Kind of get it back to some semblance of order here. And say thank you guys again for coming to my website and taking a look at my new Raspberry Pi water-cooled wall hanging project. And uh, this is part one. When I get a little closer and a little further along, I will uh, tell you guys a little bit more about it. So uh, please like or subscribe to uh, watch me as I complete this, this project. And um, thanks for stopping in. You guys uh, make it fun. Talk to you later. Bye.